So a couple of days back, I had posted a video about a free AI coding tool or vibe coding tool called as URWare AI. And the highlight was it was completely free. So you don't have to pay anything yet. You can build highly complex applications, landing pages and all that using the platform. And if you haven't watched that video already, you can click the I button or link in the description below. And today in this video, I want to introduce an incredible new feature within URWare called as boost option which will help you to take your the design of your landing pages or whatever website that you create using the platform to the next level. Not just design, it also enhances the functionality of the project that you have created. I mean, let me show you what I'm talking about today. So this right here is Yourware and the first thing that you gotta do is to click the first link in the description below and head over to their official website. And as soon as you land on this page, you will find a sign up button. So just go ahead and sign up and create a new account. And the best part, it is completely free and you don't have to pay anything. And once you log in, this is going to be the kind of interface that you'll see. And to create a new website, a landing page, a personal portfolio website or anything as such, all you gotta do is to just prompt exactly what you want to build. So towards the center, you will find an input box and describe exactly what you want to build and click the send button and the AI coding tool will take care of it. And here it says wipe coders Instagram. And to truly make it wipe coders Instagram, I won't be typing a single word manually using the keyboard instead i'd be only speaking to a ai tool and let the ai type content for me so i'm talking about a ai voice detection software called as aqua voice and if you want to use it you can just go ahead and click the second link in the description below or head over to with aqua.com and download and install this let's say ai voice detection software and again if you use the second link in the description below you can also get a 20 percent discount as well and once you have this tool installed, it's pretty simple. You can just put your cursor on the input box right here. Keep pressing the function key and I can talk whatever stuff that I want to. And the Aqua voice tool will process my voice with using AI and fill everything in here. So even if I make a mistake, Aqua will take care to fix that and fill everything, including the punctuations, formatting everything and taking care of all that kind of stuff. So as soon as I lift my uh, finger off the function key, as you can see, everything is taken care of and is filled in here. Okay. So in this case, let's say I want to build a landing page for my web development agency. So first up, we'll begin with that. So all I gotta do is to put my, let's say cursor in the input box right here and I can just go ahead and speak exactly what I want to build. So I'll press the function key and say, build a landing page for my web development agency that focuses on creating full stack websites, mobile applications, and even SaaS products. Make sure to give the website a modern and sleek look and vibe and also include some subtle animations to make it even better. So this is the initial prompt I'll give. And as soon as I lift my finger, as you can see, everything is filled for me in here. Okay. So truly vibe code is Instagram. And next step, all I gotta do is to click on the send button. And now if you have any, let's say reference files or anything as such or image files, you can click on this button right here and attach it. But for now, I'll go ahead and click on the send button. So let's wait. So right after you send the prompt, the AI will start working on your prompt and build the initial version of the website. And this right here is the interface of your where editor. So towards the left side, this is where you will find the preview of the website or web app, whatever that the AI creates for you. And towards the right side, here you can find all these chat history, all the things that the AI is doing and also give follow up prompts or commands using this input box right here. Okay. In which case we'll wait for the AI to complete the initial version and we can take it up from there. All right, so the AI has created the initial version of our website and it says, I mean, the AI named our app DevCraft, crafting digital experiences that transform. And here we have a nice subtle background. So a couple of these buttons with animation, exactly what we asked for. And here in the our services section, we have all these cards and nice animations can be found in here as well. So here we have a couple of these our work section. And the AI has even included some dummy or let's say stock images to make it pop it out. Here we have the feedback session, contact form, and also a footer. Okay. So nothing much to complete. In which ways, we'll go ahead and ask the AI to add even more features. So first up, we'll begin by asking the AI to give this now bar a glass morphism kind of an effect. So I can just go ahead and click on this select tool right here and select this navigation bar, put the cursor in here and invoke aqua and say, could you please give a glass morphism kind of an effect to the nav bar? That's all I gotta do. Hit enter and there you go. No mistake whatsoever. And now let's wait for the AI to go ahead and redesign this uh, nav bar and add a subtle glass morphism effect. All right, so there you go. So we have this subtle glass morphism kind of effect and it is working. And next up, let's just go ahead and ask the AI to include a section where it mentions 
uh, the details of all the brands that we have worked with. So I basically want to include a strip that contains, let's say, the logo of these brands. So I can go ahead and say, can you please include a strip or a section that contains the logo of the brands that we have worked with as a section just above our services section? And I can hit on the enter button. And now let's wait for it to complete coding the same. All right, so that's done. And as I scroll down, I can see logos of these random companies like PayPal, Visa, Facebook, Google, Airbnb, and Spotify in here. And that section is also added. And now I don't really like this hero section right here. So we can ask the AI to completely redesign that. So I can go ahead and invoke Aqua and say, I don't really like the hero section of our website. Could you completely redesign and change it to include some subtle gradient background some text and also some illustrations or logos or something to make it attractive include some images or something and now i can go ahead and hit enter and hopefully the ai will go ahead and redesign the zero section so let's wait okay so we asked the ai to include some images and now the ai has been searching for these images and adding the same in here so that's an interesting one so when you ask your where to include some images in your project, it goes ahead and search for the images, find it and include. Okay, in which case, let's wait. All right, so look at that. So this writer is the updated look of our hero section. So here we have this kind of a highlighted section in here with a star icon and this writer is the highlight. So here we have a image and also a couple of these icons that are floating on the screen and the image is also floating and overall the vibe of this website is actually really nice. And if I click on this button right here, I can view a full screen preview. Okay. So far, the website looks good, right? And now here comes the biggest thing that I've been talking about, the boost option. So to do that first, we'll need to publish the website or deploy the website that we created using AI. And it is pretty simple. All you got to do is to click on this publish button right here. And within seconds, the website will be deployed and URL will give you this live URL to access the same. And if I click on this link right here, I should be able to view the website that the AI has created for me. And this writer is actually a really great website, especially the hero section right here. In each ways, and now to boost the project, all you gotta do is to head back to the home page and click on your profile icon right here. And now it will take you to this page right here where you can find all the projects that you have created. And now if you click on this three dots icon right here, you will find a new option called as boost. So let me go ahead and click on the boost button right here. And now boost is in progress. So as you can see, it says brewing the perfect style and the AI is extracting all the information about the design or the website that we just developed. And now it will go ahead and create an even better version of the website without we having to do anything. So the AI will do everything on its own. So all you gotta do is to just wait. Okay. So your original project will stay intact. No changes will be made to your original project. It will create a new project based on the boosted version of this project and you can access it separately. So let's wait till it is done. All right, so URWare is done boosting the project and this is the updated look of our web development agency website. And to be honest, it is actually really sick. So the image is retained, the background has changed, the navigation bar has changed and the overall, let's say the UI of the hero section looks even better. So here we have, ooh, this animation looks good. Okay, that's good. We have our services section. My God, this is actually really great. So we have these animations in here, our portfolio section. Oh, this is also Bendo grid kind of uh, interface right here. That's cool. We have this client feedback section, contact section, and also a footer. Wow. So we went ahead and boosted our project and it entirely changed the entire look and feel of our website. And to be honest, I like this one more than the previous one. So this writer is the old design and it actually kind of looks good, but this one right here is even better is what I would say. All these floating elements, the hero section, the cards in here, this subtle animations, the typography animations and all that kind of looks really good. And this is how powerful the boost option is. So if you want to then remix and edit this particular project, all you gotta do is to click on this remix button right here and you can then go ahead and edit and make changes to the project and start editing it. For example, in this boosted project, let's say you want to change the color theme. So here we have a bluish purplish kind of a color, right? So if you want to, let's say, change it to orange, you can do that. By the way, this animation effect on the button is also actually really great. So, and now you can just head back to your and start editing it and you can click on the select button right here, 
select individual elements and make changes accordingly. For example, let's say I want to change the color of the text in this particular div to something like let's say blue. So all I gotta do is to invoke Aqua and say, could you please change the color of the text to blue? That's all I gotta do. I'll hit enter and within seconds, the AI will change the color of this text right here to blue instead of this kind of a purple kind of a color. So let's see. So right now the color has changed and it is even darker now. So in a similar fashion, you can go ahead and edit all aspect of the website entirely within your wear. So the boost feature is actually a game changer. So it works. So if you want to, you can go ahead and boost any project and change the entire look and feel of the project in a single click. You don't have to do anything. The AI will analyze the code take inspirations and also keep in mind the current layout and all structure of the page and make the required changes. So to quickly get started, all you gotta do is to click the first link in the description below, head over to yourware.so and you can then go ahead and sign up for a new account and start using it for free. And if you want to use this AI voice detection software, that is Aqua Voice, you can head over to the second link in the description below, install it. And it is a really cool tool that actually makes the whole process more enjoyable and the, you can take your vibe coding experience to the next level. So if you want to, you can click on the second link in the description below and also get a 20% discount as well, okay? So if you want that, you can do that. So that's pretty much all I wanted to show you in this video and I hope you guys found this video useful. If yes, make sure to subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.